Oh, wait, there, now it's working. Sorry, guys, I've been trying to work on the cameras this whole goddamn time. Hey, how's it going, everybody? Welcome to the Weary 101. Your king is here. I apologize. I was sitting on the throne a little bit too long because that's why uh, I'm always uh, bringing that king shit. You know what I mean? Hi, everybody. Hi. Welcome to the Weary 101, everybody. Big Siggy Art, thanks so much for the shot. Enjoy Pepper and Nia Nia. Thank you so much for the shot as well. Thank you all for swinging on by the bar as well. The bills I cannot thank properly. Thank you so much, Otis. I'm a Zen. To all of you, I want to thank Fireman for the two shots. Get it to the bar. Hey, yo, that's very kind of you. Well, welcome, everybody. Fireman, hey, thank you for the 1,000 bits, and you get what's left of the bar shot. Well, shit. Hope you enjoy. Icky, kicky, you're the one. Ba -ba -ba. How's it going there, guys? Now, guys, welcome to the Weary 101, where you're not judged from where you came from, but you are judged on where you're going. Now, enjoy that drink there. Enjoy it. And don't sip it all in one place, but it's time for that age-old question, everybody. How is your Thursday going? Huh? How's your day? Hey, what's up? No, I... No. <laughs> Who the... Did you just ask me how my, my, my day was going? Yeah, I was... Tell you. Who the bloody hell are you? Oh, yeah. yeah oh, I... Yeah, we... I, um... You don't know me. My name's Crumbo. I've been peeking into your windows looking for a new hangout. And, uh, yeah, this joint looks perfect. Oh! Well, you're a grower, not a shower, and you're a little bit of the shower as well. Everybody, this is Crimbo. Crimbo, you... you I, I, now, wait, hold on. Are you one of the local gang leaders? Oh, yes, yes. I run the Neon Knight Riders gang, and we got cool people in it like uh, Rael and Peony, and we got a bunch of other cool people, and we fight the skinks, and they're another gang, and they're, they got Rummy and uh, Koki in it, and they, they're, they're terrible. They're the, the worst gang. We're the best gang. Neon Knight Riders, best gang. N neon Knight Riders. Yeah, 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 yeah. The Neon, uh, the Neon Knight. I gotta write that name down, everybody. Okay, so, who, um, so, who's, whose turf am I on? Oh, you're now on my turf because I've just claimed this is my new hangout. Oh, that's really cool. Well, it's well, I mean, yeah, I mean, you, it's cool that you want to make it a hangout. Hell, guy, guys, welcome, welcome the Riders here. Hell yeah, man. Well, God yeah, I'm damn. super into this place. You, really, you, you like you like it so well. Thank you so much. I'm glad you're enjoying it. I love uh, I love the amount of booze you got, and and I like that uh, we got a we got a pretty little man here. Talk about you. Ah, oh, shit. I was worried about that. Yeah, you're gorgeous. I I need a gorgeous man to serve me drinks. You know what, Crimbo? I appreciate the compliment. So let's make you a beverage. What would you like, Crimbo? Oh, oh, you got uh, you got any of them Zemos? No. I only drink things that end in O. So you got you got Zemos? Zemos. Do I have Zemos? Yeah, you heard of Zemos, right? I think I think my one of my brother, like one of my one of my family members, had eczema. But you know what? Don't worry about it. Since this is my joint now, I'll go in the back and I'll help myself. I, you're gonna do. Yeah. You're gonna, I'll, I'll be right back. One sec. What, what do you mean, be right back? What? I. What do you? What do you do? Hey, oh my! I just. Uh, oh! I'm just helping myself in the back room here. Oh no! Oh no! No, Crimbo. Oh, you got a lot of good stuff back that's, here. What are you? That's. There's. Why is there so much glass? Why, why do you have this? What? What? How old is this? That is, that is an heirloom. It's been in my family for years. Well, it's delicious. I. I, I just, uh, I'm gonna help myself to a couple snacks back here. I'll be right back, guys. I am. Why, why do you have to destroy so much? Get where you're going. I'm a big guy. Can't help it. I'm I sorry. Just, sorry. I'm... Okay. Okay. I think I found it. I found yep. it. I'm coming out. Oh, you are. Yeah, I got my drink. I got my drink. Why don't you go back through the wake and what you may? Oh, Jesus. Christ on a cracker. I, I'm, I'm good. I'm refreshed. I got my drink. Thank you so much. You're a very good, sexy bartender that has uh, refreshed me. You have done your job. You get to live another day. But I don't want to. 
You don't want to live another day? Not after oh, you... what you've done to the bar. <laughs> Heavy is the head that wears the crown. Ow. Yeah, it looks pretty heavy. If it's too heavy for you, just give it to me. I'll be your king. <laughs> no, it's my crown. I'm going to put it away now. That's okay. I'll find it later. I'll oh, find gee. everything. I feel like I've been bullied a little bit here today. But Crimbo, people got to know, aside from you being the leader of your own gang, like where, where, like, where, where can they find you and what do you, what do, you do? Well, you what can no longer find me in prison. That's where I used to be. That's good. So, well, hey, again, you're not judged from where you came from. You're judged from where you're going. <laughs> so yeah, after leaving prison, uh, I run, I run, uh, I run my own arcade. Uh, it's in the Unnight Riders arcade, and as a side hustle, I draw, I draw porn. If you're into that. Maybe. Okay, let's talk. You got uh, you got money. I got drawing powers. <laughs> I you know what I'm you have you, you have. Uh, you, goodness me, Crimbo! You've got me all. Uh, I gotta thank Apocalypse for gifting that shot to Kukui Monster. And Travis ain't carry for 120 bits. So this uh, so 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 you, you por porn, por yeah, as yeah. in pornography. Yeah, and I ain't picky. Whatever hand ties or. Mentis or lentis or lentils, whatever you want, I'll make it for you. Gentiles? Yeah, we got gentiles. <laughs> we don't we don't discriminate. Maybe sometimes we should. Maybe. Maybe that's someone else's job, but it ain't my job to discriminate. You come you come to me, you tell me what you want, you bring the cash, I make it happen. So is that, is that kind of how the gang also started up? Similar mentality? Simple, 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 similar energy? Oh, uh, yeah, our gang, pretty much so. But, uh, yeah, Rummy and Koki, they're a bunch of squares. So, yeah, don't worry about them. They ain't, they ain't so much into that. Rummy and Koki, I serve a fair amount of those. Oh, you do? Yes. Uh, maybe, maybe they'd like this joint, but they ain't allowed in. Because it's my joint now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so, hey, hey, hey. Yes. I, I want to know more about my uh, pretty new bartender boy. <laughs> uh, uh, well, Archie Home just ordered themselves a shot, uh, courtesy of the bar. I hope you enjoy. Okay, okay. So you want to know a little bit more about me? Well, I uh, yeah, I inherited this uh, bar like my like well like my mom did, gave it to my uncle. Uh, well, like sorry, my uncle had it. And he passed away, and you know, kind of was in a low point in my life, and I you know kind of contacted my mom and. You know, she just inherited this from her brother, so she uh, gave it to me, and I moved cross country and uh, opened up here, and now I am in uh, your gang's turf. So that's where we're at right now okay. in the adventure. And, and you're telling me this entire time, this entire adventure, from you going from no bar to getting a bar, uh, you, you fight anybody? How many? How many people you kill on the way to get your bar? Well, no, not, not from the from like that low point to here. I no one, no, no, I didn't kill anybody. Uh, no one Nobody. died. No one died. I mean, I not had, even a small little guy who's talking too much. Well, I mean, they kind of. I don't want to be that guy. Oh, you know, it's okay. I'm here now. Tunic I'm gonna take care of you, my pretty little man. I will kill yeah. all the people that need killing around here. I, that is, a, I believe that is a crime. Eh, it's not a crime if you don't get caught. It's only a crime if you're prosecuted. And it's only a job if the tax man takes money from you. That's true. Mm -hmm. I don't have no job then. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not a good thing to admit. Oh, no! Liam Cax, okay. Liam Cax getting themselves a shot. And also, Tuna Glitter gifting a shot to Rummy Bear. Well, thank you so much there. Now, the Crimbo. The Crimbo. Now, you're, uh, now, now, do you have any nicknames for you? Uh, yeah, it, chat. Sound off all the cool nicknames I got. Rummy and Koki, I see you in the chat, so don't you participate, but y'all, y'all can, uh, y'all can just say all the nicknames I got. Because I forget them all. Versus, if we don't say Crimbo's amazing, he's going to prove that how amazing he uh, truly is. And, hey, Otisima said, and Aurora Rose, enjoy the shot. Is that... 
Oh, yeah. oh, ah. oh my goodness. We're serious. King Criminal. Yep, that's true. King of the Criminals. Uh, they did. That was my original gangster name, and no one wanted to call me King of Criminals. And so, uh, yeah. yeah, they call me Crumbo instead. <laughs> They call, they you call me Crumby. Yeah. Crumbo, I mean, I as as a as a himbo, I want to, you to know that I find you, Crimbo, giving off a similar energy. Yes, uh, I, I feel the vibe. I can work with a guy like this. You can. I I, I appreciate that. Don't go behind him. You're you're going to die. Thank you. Hey, and Lenny Pator, with a raid of 62 people here in oh, the Weary 101. People. Yes, yes, yes. We're being raided right now in the middle. Oh, and there's the gut check. From yeah, Primo. Let me them with my gut while you uh while you give them the pretty words from your pretty mouth. This is uh this is a hip this is hypnosis actually, everybody. Hypnosis. 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 Yeah, hypnosis. That, now you're all working for me. Oh, working hard for the money? Or are you working hard or hardly uh working? No matter as long as it's hard, we're good. So back to the porn. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, um, anything goes except for, you know, the crime stuff? Yeah, no crime stuff. Okay. Uh, because even I got standards. Yes, but, yes. But, you know, uh, if, if you want some, some goo, or you want, like, um, you want, like, wait, a crazy wait, wait, mask. Wait, 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 wait. Now, a lot of words I expected to come out of, to come out of you, but the word yeah. goo... Yep. Interesting. Are you are you a goo man? Uh, yes. And allow me to prove that right now by marking some of my territory around here. What? 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 Shut the ah! Oh! Oh! Oh my God! It's on me. No ah. oh God! What are you doing? What are you? Oh God! It's so moist. It's so moist. Ah. <laughs> uh. Let's get a little more on. Uh, okay, good. This is good. Oh, okay. uh, God. It's so moist. Uh, uh. <laughs> now, now I can shake it. <laughs> it feels okay. frozen. You'll get, you'll get used to it. Moist. It's, it's so moist. See, and now you're hydrated, and now you're moisturized. You're all good to go. Yes. I really feel great, Grimbo. Well, you look great. Where can people find such remedies? Where is your social media? <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't know. I got people to do that. <laughs> you okay? Oh, uh, no. I'm luckily, I have harmless tobacco to, like, fill up my lungs. I'll be okay. They were just moisturizing your insides because, you know, smoke, it could dry you out. It's true. I'm glad I have Crimbo's goo. I'm glad you do. I'm glad you do, too. Is it going to go away? Is the goo going to go away? I, yeah. I mean, not with a heavy wash. It's pretty sticky stuff, you know? It really does feel stuck to me. Uh, here, here. Let me clean you up. Let me clean you up. Oh, I, oh thank you. I mean, just... God, I right, just a little more. There we go. And uh, yeah, one more. There we go. We good. Crambo, did you eat the silica gel when you were a kid? What did you not? Was I not supposed to? I don't think we were. That's why I what said do happen? not eat. It wasn't a challenge. It was a warning. Hey, no one can. No packaging's gonna tell Crimbo what he can and cannot eat. <laughs> Speaking of peace to you, Crimbo. Peace to you. I'm, 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 I'm. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so Crimbo. Yeah, so, yeah, so yeah. tell us, tell us now. I let's go back to the porn thing. 
It's just, it's, it's, an it's an interesting dichotomy. What is the most recent piece that you can tell us about that you can't show us? Well, mm, let me think, let me think. Uh, you know what? I have, I have, I work with um, models sometimes and they always want, uh, they always want pretty anime kind of um, profile banners. And they always come to Crimbo because Crimbo does a good job. Yeah. Yeah. And, and and any sexy person comes to my door with cash and says, "Hey, you draw me," I ain't gonna say no. What the hell? Why not? And so we work out a deal, and yeah. That does sound like a crime, crime the way you describe it, actually. Uh, maybe a crime against my parents' feelings. Well, I mean, we're all only here because our parents looked at one another and went, mm, "I fancy that." Yeah, I, I kind of wonder how my parents got into that because they kind of odd look a couple. They look a lot like me. They, they almost look like each other, and then they also look like me. So that's the whole thing. Well, that's. I, so I like um, colors. Do do, do do where do you get your lips from? Wh which of your family members? Uh, uh so my my mom, she got she got the more voluptuous lips, and my dad. Yeah. He looks like he uh, he drowned, and so he's got the more purple he looks. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Interesting. So, uh, tell me, tell me, I want to know, uh, what kind of what kind of patrons we can we expect around here? Who's your who's your favorite? Who Mo can uh, yeah, who can we get money out of? Who can we get money out of? Uh, yeah. well, it's not a matter of looking. I mean, I mean. Maybe there are a couple marks here. I don't know. I haven't thought about it that way in a long time. Do tell. I, well, no, I don't. I don't try not to do crime. You know, it just it comes naturally to me. Okay. 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 I, 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 Daydream Rogue. That, let, we'll get to questions here in a moment. Uh, let me just kind of see here. Hey, Onizaimasen. Okay. So right now, who I'm seeing right now, that artsy grandpa. We can get we can get a lot of hugs out of them. I think. But that's about oh, yeah. it. I mean, hugs are worthwhile currency, right? Hell yeah, I'll always take a hug. There Hug's go. at least worth uh, 25 cents. Yeah, that's pretty good, actually. Yeah. You want a hug from me? It's 50 cents, because I'm worth like two hugs. That's true. It is, you're like, it's like being hugged by four people at once. Yep, yep. Mm -hmm. Corvax, you'll never see get never get my bits. Wait a minute. Well, Corvax42, think of the 550 bits, and you're going to the Cat Teddy drink machine. That You're going into Crimbo. You're going right into Crimbo. Why, why are you doing? Why are you doing? <laughs> don't, don't you be there goes, around. there goes that drink. Enjoy it all in one place. Oh my goodness! I had a little extra goo for you. A little extra goo. Yeah, a little goop. A little goo. Yeah, yeah. Some so does it, lime. does it hurt to know that Gwyneth Paltrow stole your name? Oh yeah, I got beef with her. You got beef with she, Gwyneth she Paltrow. Better not, uh, she better not come into this bar or the wrong alley, because I got words for that that Gwyneth. It, it, you her didn't... and her rocks, and her goo, her goo. I, 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 I mean, I mean this. You gotta know, Gwen Paltrow has had such a rough time that they had to eat bread. And we um. are being raided by Mango, Mango B, Mango B Tuber. I love Mango oh. B, Mango B Tuber, Mango B, Mango B, B, B Tuber. Mango. Love is so much fun with Mango B. Mango. Bingo, bingo. Okay, I saw insert something clever and witty and funny there. Think about the 500 bits, Okane san. And we're being ridden by Mango, my goodness. Benjo the bird nerd. Ahoy, Taka. Man, this whole bar is for the nerds. The whole bar is for the nerds, Crimbo. There's a whole lot of people lurking around here. Oh, yeah. I think we got I think we've got a couple hundred people in this bar right now, Crimbo. They, 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 they're scared of going to other bars now. Beautiful man. You are a good investment. I, I'm a good, you know what? That is a hell of a nice compliment. Corrupt, 2969. Nice, with 505 bits. Go and enjoy that shot. On its way to you, though. Benjamin the Bird Nerd, thank you again. Make a to tuber. Burb drink, please. On its way to you. Yeah, I've been uh, I've been hanging out outside the bar, looking in the window, make sure there weren't no coppers hanging around. And I thought, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a good new hangout for Grimbo. This is the place for me. You got colorful drinks. You got the Zemos. I got yeah, the yeah. Zemos. I still ho hope I have the Zemos. 
I, I gotta say, and, and Julio Uchiha, thank you so much for grabbing that shot. Thank you so much. And Otis Ima said to you as El Luna Rova. My goodness, my goodness. Hey, I got a question for you. You got a question for me? I got oh, a million I'm questions gonna, for you then. I, I get snacky. I get snacky. Yeah. So what what kind of um foods ending in O you got lying around here? I actually, uh, let's see what I have here. Uh, let me see what I have here for items for you to eat. Uh, um, hold on, hold on. Um... Uh, would you, uh, wait, uh, it's not a, would you like to eat this cigar? Uh, yeah, yeah, no. Give it to me. I'll give it a shot. You can give it a shot? Okay, you can have this wonderful cigar here. This is a, uh, oh. this is a big, this is a big sucker here. This is just. Oh, I can eat that. I can fit that. All right, here we go. Uh, oh, but hold on, hold on. I gotta, I gotta adjust. Hold on. I gotta, uh, all right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah, that was good. That's that, good. Dude. It's like a uh, big Slim Jim. Yeah, slam into a Slim Jim. Holy fuck. Uh, I, gotta, I gotta find some more uh, things for you uh, to eat. You gotta slam it in your taco hole. So I have a question for you, Krimbo. Yes, yes. When is your next stream? Now we have a lot of people here. I think this is the time for you to plug where they can find you outside of being here at my bar because I'm apparently part of your turf now. <laughs> That's a good question. I don't even know. But, hey, since you're all here, I'll make the extra effort. Let me see if I can uh, pull up the old schedules for you. I want to imagine you have this tiny little flip note thing, put on little glasses. Mm -hmm. Pencil you in. <laughs> Oh, man. So uh, I don't I don't make no schedule. I don't pay attention to no schedule. Koki does that. That's nerd stuff. Oh, yeah, that's it is nerd stuff to be fair. So uh, let me let me take a look. Okay. okay. Hey, John Side Gaming, two hundred bits. Ask for food that start with an O. Talk and gives them a cigar to eat. The, run, the you run a bar. Don't you have an oranges for garnish that ends with an O? I don't have one that ends with an O. Damn. Taco uh, shrimp. Okay. Happy to be here, Taka. Thank you so much for being here as well. Okay, okay. Okay, so, so yeah. Yeah. It was, if I'm not mistaken, today's Thursday. Is that the day? Yes, today today, today is now. Thursday. Okay. Yeah. And tomorrow that would make tomorrow um frying day. Frying day. Frying so Fry, wait, uh, ing, frying day. Ing day. Frying. Yeah, we could all go KFC tomorrow. But I I don't I don't stream tomorrow, but uh Koki streams tomorrow at 7 p.m. and then Saturday then I stream at se at 7 p.m. and that's uh that's Central Time, yeah. So usually around seven, that's when we party. Hell yeah, man! Friday, Saturday, yeah. Friday, sa Saturday. Alrighty, man. Well, now people know where they're that's where they can check that out there because we've been. Do you want to know what it is I'm gonna do? I'm terrified. Oh, you should be. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> all right, all right. So. Here's the thing. I run the arcade. And yeah. I, I love beat em up games. Yeah. And I, I, I style myself after a, you know, level one boss in a beat em up game. That's kind of my thing. So. The energy you're giving off, man. Is I work on. I live in the south side in a junkyard. Mm -hmm. But I like to work on lore and, um, and video game stuff. So I'm kind of planning a beat em up game for fun. And if you come to my stream, I draw stuff, I talk about game mechanics. I play games and then think about what kind of mechanics I want to steal for my game, which will be a beat em up. Yeah, all that uh, kind of stuff. I, a lot of conceptual. What I like is that you want to play games to know what works to take that. Yeah, that you is a. Know what's worth stealing. Here's the thing. That's not. That's not the. Well, they, I heard. I heard the great borrow the truly great steal. Mm. Uh, here's the thing. Uh, World of Warcraft stole from every other MMO. Oh yeah. And they stole yeah, the combat. Yeah. They stole the PVP system entirely from Dark Age of Camelot. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah. Had the best played. PVP system at the time. They went, oh, we'll just take that then. Well, I I played uh, I played Ragnarok online. Do you know what that stole from? Oh fuck. <laughs> what did that one steal from? I don't know. Like everything, it's got slimes from like Dragon Quest. It really does. It really is like a homogenized version. Of yeah, that. it's got like the, the little sprite guys from Final Fantasy Tactics, kinda. Mm -hmm. John Side Gaming with a real quick quest. Uh, after he said beat him up stuff, I did realize he does look like a birdie. Probably my favorite character to play in Street Fighter. Oh, I love birdie. Me and him go way back. Oh, man. That's oh, you do? Shit. 
All right, so yeah, here's a question. We have a question. So does, does Krimbo ever get mistaken for Birdie from Street Fighter? Well, that was a question just a minute ago. <laughs> well, did you guys mistake me from Birdie? I have I have much better lips than that guy. I like, mean, he's cool and all, but I'm sexier. <laughs> I, yeah, yeah. Birdie's a bit intimidating. Oh, yeah. Birdie doesn't show it. Bert, you, you're working it. You're working it there, Krimbo. Oh, I'm not going to lie. There's less shenanigans here in the bar now that you're standing up here looking intimidating. It's really working. Yeah, there better not be. No, that's that, that is fantastic. Normally, I have an out-of-control like moose running around in here. Just let me deal with it. Okay. If it I happens. Got, got and if they screw around, I'm going to flip out. I'm just going to I'm going to go nuts. Try and try and focus on peace. Try and focus on peace okay. before violence. Peace before violence. Okay, let, let me let me take that back. Let, 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 hold on one second. I'm so sorry if I scared you. I do want to be friends. Just call me a little closer. Come a come a little closer. Okay, to the okay, okay, okay. And then I got you. <laughs> and then I'm gonna hold you. And then I'm gonna really mess you up. <laughs> it's okay, pretty boy. You're safe with me. I ain't gonna mess you up. <laughs> I don't believe you. You can come in, come in, come in. Just come here. Okay, I'm, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm coming. I'm coming. That's okay. You smell me and my strong musk. That's how you know you're safe. That's Old Spice body wash. That's what that is. It's a bunch of stuff. I mix them all together. <gasps> you do the swamp water? <laughs> yeah, why wouldn't you? It's, uh, you get more stink for your money. That's true. It's a particular smell that doesn't smell that bad. I can tell you, if, if there's anything that's uh, smelling that you want to get rid of, just do that, and your problem solved. You won't smell it no more. That's yeah, true. I really will, like, really will uh, destroy your nose. It's... Amongst other things, it's a little bit of your nervous system, a little bit of your lymph node system. That, kiss that goodbye. I, oh, I need that to walk, I think. And breathe. Wait, is, that, is that what your lymph node system does? I have no idea what it does. I, I don't thought, know. I'm not a doctor. I'm a bartender. Uh, so I thought uh, it was like lymph node, like lift, like lymph nodes. I, I When I first heard the term, I heard nymph nodes. So I was like, whoa, what? Uh, 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 I'm into that. Sign me up for the nymph nodes and the nymph toads. Yo. Where can we get some nymph toads? You got nymph toads that come into this bar? Listen, I know the red light district is like two blocks down. They got toads? They got loads. Or rather, oh. they can take them. Loads of toads. I, yeah, sign me up. I'm going. I'm going. What else can I make for you there, Crimbo? Hey, uh, you got any toad type drinks? I now I'm God in the mood. damn it. Now you're in the mood, huh? Yeah, do you have anything called it, like a salty toad? Uh, I want a salty toad. I got I got the big croak. Oh, give me a big croak. I'll give you the big croak. It's based on Naruto, which became wizard pow superpower <laughs> battles. Oh, okay. What's in that? Uh, I, I pretty much take a frog. I put it in the mixer and I put a bunch of vodka in there and the color blue. The greatest Ooh. flavor. It sounds delicious. Mm, thank you. Sounds like it's got lots of vitamin um, F. It, what you call F. Yeah, frog. <laughs> yeah, yeah, vitamin F. What is vitamin F good for anyway? I, I gotta it's wonder. Your, it's for your femur. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Make your make your funny bone work. Make you a funnier man. Exactly. So, man. what kind of drinks and vitamins are you putting in you to make you so beautiful? Oh man. In this moment right now, I don't drink a lot of alcohol. By a lot, I mean any at all. I'm actually two years sober off the stuff. Oh, congrats. Thank you very much. But I've been drinking a lot of H2O, a lot of bubbly, which is a carbonated beverage. Is uh, that why you look so moist and soft? It's unrelated. Oh, okay. okay. Yeah, it's unrelated. It's later. Probably. Uh, so, but uh, I also have been drinking. That's right. One of the sponsors here in the Weary 101. That's right. We're sponsored by G Fuel here, everybody. W101. Whoa. One of my favorite flavors. I've been drinking Shiny Spark, which is a blueberry flavor lately. 
Mm, 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 mm. That sounds good. I'll sign up for that. Yeah, yeah. It's not too. Sh it's not too. Sh it's not too shabby. It's not too shabby. And the other flavor I like is the blackberry one, and that's mostly okay. because blackberry as a flavor doesn't need sugar to taste good. Okay, when I'm out of here, I'm gonna take a crate with me. Sure. Yeah, I can't. Probably can't stop you on that one. No, so, no, you can't. Uh, I, I, I think you outclass me and outweight division me uh, by about three. Yeah, yeah, a, co a couple threes. Has anyone ever it's mistaken okay. you for a professional wrestler? I wish. Oh my gosh. Uh, no, my, that's more my buddy uh, Andori, Andori, uh, Hugo, Hugo Andori's job. He does that kind of shit. Oh, but uh, yeah, no, I'd love it if he invited me. I'd love to do wrestling. I think I think you'd be pretty good at it. I think you got have the you, I think you got the look. Have you ever decided to, to try wrestling out? Would you like to wrestle? I don't think I could ever be a wrestler, but I know what I could be. The best fucking manager ever. Ooh, I okay. will get heat. Oh man, I will get my talent over as fuck by telling the truth. Oh my god, that sounds fun. Mm -hmm. All right. If you're looking to to manage your real eyes, maybe we should uh, get it talking. Uh, I, 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 I'm not. I'm not gonna lie, Crimbo. I, 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 I'm not gonna lie. I think if if I was the manager for you, I think that would be batshit crazy. And I also think yeah. that I don't think people would have enough money to afford you because of what a fucking megastar you would be. People never got enough money. That's why you gotta yeah. just take what you can get out of their pockets. Exactly. 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 Here's the thing. What you're gonna do? Mm. You're gonna make. You're gonna make it big. As a matter of fact. Let me show you some of my championships. Would you like to see some of the championships Wait. I have acquired over the years? Oh, dude. I would love to show you some of my championship. Some of my championship yeah, goals. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Let's see some of these champies. I'll, I'll, I'll grab them. I'm going to grab them here. Hold on one second. Now I stole this one. That's right. Oh, oh no, no. That's that just a, that's, that's a world championship one. Ignore that one. Oh, Ignore. That one's not the right that's, one. That one's not like a, a ring for me. Nah, yeah, it wouldn't. It's not fitting for you. It's not. A, it's not a fitting championship, actually. Hold on. I need to grab the other belt because I'm just gonna remember. Oof. Like, in case, here's the thing. You might have to be one of those shoulder guys who puts the belt on the shoulder. I know yeah, not yeah. everyone likes those dudes, but yeah, this is the championship I stole. Oh wow, look at that one. This is the New Legacy Inc. Championship. I actually stole it from New Legacy oh. Inc. See that right there? Wow, I'm proud of you. Yeah, thank you very good. much. It really, uh, really was quite simple. Quite simple, actually. One second. I, I like how uh, if you put it on, it just falls down to your feet. You got to cinch true. that belt. Yeah, it's true. I, I don't exactly got weight meat on me. Maybe when they were uh, making these there belts, we are. They, there we might are. have been envisioning uh, someone a little bit bigger. Hey, hey, I have abs, even if they're default abs, okay? Oh, no, I, I don't I got it. I have an eight pack and it's not because I'm malnourished. I'll have you know But uh, but do you have the obtuse caboose? That's what I want to know. I have a cake. That is a mistake uh, That sounds delicious. Thank you very much. It sounds is, like an all-you-can-eat meal. It's a wedding cake uh, That's good. Be, be sure to blow out the candles on that thing first If you told me fail to blow them all out. You have a bunch of secret boyfriends though yeah, yeah, that, them's the rules. That can't take it away. That's <laughs> good, that's good. That's good work there, Crimbo. That's great work there, Crimbo. You know what, I think it's time to go to social media, Crimbo. Okay, let's and, do it. Because I'm going to ask a bunch of questions. Because I threw up a thing where people could ask questions of us. Oh, yes, let's do it. Let's, let's, see, what, let's, see, let's see what questions they have for us, Crims. Let's smartalize these nerds. Absolutely. You know what? Yes. <laughs> oh man, the comments on this one. <laughs> I think I found my senpai or my spirit animal. That's from Danny DX, referring to, of course, to Kim Krimbo. Oh, that's Danny DeVito talking. And that is Artsy Grandpa. I'm super hyped and excited for all of those who can drop by. These two were fantastic. Well, thank you, Artsy Grandpa. Oh yeah, that's sweet. That's very nice of you, Artsy Grandpa. All right, now I'm gonna go grab the other one because that was the first one. Because there were two actually we threw up. And. Ba, 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 ba. Wait, what did we throw up? No, not yet. I haven't thrown up yet, Grimbo. Okay. 
Uh, All you right. So someone said, okay, are you, uh, you'll really find a lot of interesting guest talk. Huh? I, I, I was just told that Krimbo was showing up. I, I, I was just told, Krimbo, I'm swinging by. Who's a guest? I own this joint now. <laughs> but in like the crime way, not like the official government right, document right. way, right? Yeah. Different yeah, ownership. Exactly. Different ownership. Yeah. yeah. Different ownership. Yeah, it's, like, it's like, it's like, it's like there's turf. Like even some cats yeah. and dogs will consider this their turf. But we all respect the turf system. It, all you gotta do is just give me a little bit of extra booze, a little bit of that um cash out of your drawer, and I'll make sure you're protected. And ain't nobody going to come over and try to protect you because I'm already protecting you. That sounds like a very healthy relationship. I think I'm down to make right? that work. Yeah, yeah, I really... Everyone wants to be protected and held and pushed into a soft, squishy bosom and they sink in and feel warm and that's comforted. True. Yeah. Everyone true. wants that. Uh, yeah, you know, and that's what yeah. Krimbo's protection is going to do for you. So sign up today. Is it KPS, Krimbo Protection Services? Yeah, we could do, we could do that. Yeah, I mean, honestly, you got—I feel like you got a lot of branding, Crimbo. There's just so much that you could do. A lot to do, Crimbo. And I mean—I mean this as a compliment. You look like you're about to defeat a Yu-Gi-Oh protagonist. Oh, I plan to. I think I'm in a Yu-Gi-Oh uh, tournament. Well, I'm—I'm pl gonna play a gangster deck. Good, good. I'm—I'm I'm yep. very happy that you're going that way. I'm already there. My first up, uh, my first opponent's gonna be Velik. If anyone knows Velik, she's going down. Her and her dump truck. The dump truck's going down? Yeah, it's gonna be Battle of the Dump Trucks in card form. Oh, that's fair. I mean, like, you're, well, you're the junkyard. You represent the junkyard, they represent the yeah. dump. Yeah, someone's gonna get junked in the dump. That's all I know. That's all I know now, too. And that's what I'll tell the police. We have already everybody. What is Krimbo's favorite Pokemon? Oh, that's a good Ooh. question there. Yeah, Krimbo, what is your favorite Pokemon? Oh God, it's so. Uh, I'm gonna. I gotta say, Obstagoon. I love his color scheme. Uh, all, my whole setup in the hideout is all like uh, white, black, and magenta, because I in gray, because I just love Obstagoon and that he just he obstructs. That's cool. I'm into that. Fuck yeah. Obstruction pose. That's good. That's good. Oh man, look at this. Look, look, honestly, Krimbo, this is this is this is a good look actually. Hold on. May, can I can I like stand behind you and with the championship and look like I'm like Shawn Michaels in behind you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well. And what's your uh, favorite Pokemon while we're at? Oh, my favorite Pokemon? Scyther, because he's got blades for arms. Oh, uh, that's yeah, that's cool. I bet he can mix a mean drink. I bet he can chop up all my limes. All oh, my yeah. limes. Oh, you should hire him. Oh yeah, this we look like a squad right now. Look at this, like squad up. What are you gonna yeah, do? Yeah, you can't yeah. take this championship of new legacy ink, and if you can't get to me, that just means you're too weak. Crimbo, stand in front of yeah, me. Yeah, too weak. Yeah. We're gonna mess you up. <laughs> too bad for you. It's ours. We're gonna take turns stepping on you. Oh damn! Tell you what, you can take my turn because I think you step with more purpose than I. That's okay. I'll I'll step all all the times you want me to, baby. <laughs> oh, Crimbo, you're so perfect. How can, we need to get your DNA and clone more of you so we can every everyone can have a Crimbo. I'm into that. No. Now, now, folks, we have Crimbo here for only I don't know how long we can keep his attention. For goodness uh, knows how. Ah, God. So, folks. I'm getting bored. Oh shit! He wants some questions. Uh, uh, people ask Crimbo questions. He's got answers. He's got cues for that giant A. He got giant yeah, A's for those tiny cues. Don't make me flip out on yous. Oh, shit. What are the tattoos on Crimbo? There we go. What are the tattoos on Crimbo? Okay, let's take a look. Yeah, let's take a look here. Let's uh, let's let's check your ink. Let's check that ink. So we, we, got, that, um, we got that lovely succubus uh, in the middle. Succubus mark in the middle. Okay. Letting people know I'm full of love and organs. That's good. And, and then we got some quarter circles because I like my arcade games. Oh, that's fair. And then you can't see it, but uh, we got a little... I like video game music a lot. So the very tail end is uh, music notes. It is uh, music uh, cheat, cheat uh, bars, whatever. Damn. That's pretty sweet. I, I really do like that. Um, have you heard the uh, soundtrack to Valhalla? Oh, no. Please hook me up. Please give me a link to that. Okay. So this is a... I'm going to ask you... So, uh, we actually have a lot of really fun questions coming in here. Crimbo, okay. while I'm grabbing this for you, what is your favorite sure. dinner? Uh, you know, 
I think the thing with the most O's in it, in name and appearance, will be SpaghettiOs. So I gotta go with SpaghettiOs as number one meal, has all the vitamins, has all the O's you could need. That's true. That's pretty you, you good. Gotta, you gotta drink uh, that, that incorporates a SpaghettiO? Uh, yeah, it is an interesting uh, drink, though. It is it is pretty much as far as a Caesar can go. It's pretty much me just pouring uh, half an ounce of vodka into SpaghettiOs with Tabasco sauce and a bunch of uh, other... Ooh, yeah. can I name it for you? Absolutely. Okay, can we name that one the Sloppy-O? The Sloppy-O? Yeah. You know what? I'm pretty sure an artist might just draw that, and I might be able to hand it to you. Yeah, yeah, no, it will go full circle with that bit. Now I'm gonna pl I'm gonna send you a soundtrack here. Uh, I need you to go to zero zero with it on, on your end here to sync up because okay. you can't hear it uh, at the same time as me. So, okay. yeah, I don't think you can. Could you hear the music? No. All righty. Uh, you got the link? Yeah, I'm gonna go look. All righty, on the count of three, okay? Okay. One, two, three. Relax. This is good. Now, this is a, uh, it's a, this is made by Michael Kelly, and this is actually one of the soundtracks I listened to while I was dealing with my, uh, addiction and sobriety issues. And oh, wow. some of this music actually got me through it. Yeah. So when you said you like, like video you game music. This. Yeah, no, you're gonna, there's gonna be one track in particular I think you're gonna love. Mm. So, no. So this is one of my favorite OSTs for video games. And this is, and I am happy that I get to share it with you as a lover of video game music. This All sounds right. uh, introspective. I'm still at the start of the track, so. Yeah, yeah, no worries, no worries. I, I am as well here. Speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh, did you hear that the retailers like Walmart aren't selling Yu-Gi-Oh cards or Pokemon cards or even freaking baseball cards anymore? Yes, I did what? hear about that. No more. What what, what the hell? Why are they giving up that scam? It's a good scam. It's because too many others have gotten in on a scam, man. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know, you ever go in there and you see the open up packs and they took all the cool coins and stuff out? Dude, I wanted to find those kids and beat them up. Yeah, I've beaten up a few. I've ca I've caught them outside. I grab them. I'm happy. I rob them and I throw them into a dumpster. Crimbo, I am very happy that you beat up those children. I'm happy too. I feel uh, I feel more uh, more strong. The Good. More, uh, beat well, of course, up a you're so guy. you're so much bigger than them, obviously. Yeah, that's mm. what they get for being smaller than me. Yeah, it's their fault. Now, see how this mm. the, the the build. This is just the pre-screen. Yeah, uh, this is it's just swelling. You know, they, and this is why I love the, the I, I don't really know if I'm using, even using these words properly, but I love the composition of this. Mm -hmm. It's just, it's just really strikes really hard when it kicks in. I, to, we're going to ask, answer questions throughout this whole thing. I have another question for you sure. from somebody from Super Mega sure, Dude sure. Guy. How little effort would it take for Crimbo to snap you in half? Uh, why, why even use the word effort? <laughs> why is effort even in that sentence? When it comes to me snapping you in half? There is no E word. It doesn't exist. We could try to find it. <laughs> nah, we could. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, Ooh, oh my god, thank you. Me now. That's right. It is I'm a Zen. It is I'm a Zen. A bunch of people just ran in here. My goodness. Did you do you beat up old people though? That's from Artsy Grandpa Crimbo. Do you beat up uh, the old people? Only when they pay for it. That's a, all right. That's a fair policy. That's a fair you policy. Know, Gramps walks into my into my abode and is like, "Hey, here's a hundred bucks. Throw me around the room a bit." Hey, what am I gonna say? I'm not gonna say no to that. Sorry, I'm adjusting the audio, but you are completely correct. Oh, this music so smooth. You know, this music really uh, vibes with you. You're a smooth guy. You got smooth skin. Uh, you got smooth hair. Oh, th thank you. It's because of it's smooth music. It's because of the goo earlier. I think the goo really helped out my complexion. Okay, okay. The bottleneck goo. Yeah, I'm into this. Here, here comes the next one. Here comes the next one. It's just a build up. Again, it's building up to the actual first track. Because this is okay. now like the select screen. We like, bloop, bloop, bloop. you're hopping around here. This is just to get you into the vibe of where you're going. Now, now, what I like to do when I listen to music like this, I close my eyes and I imagine what I'm doing to this music. So, can you close your eyes and you can you tell me what you see? 
Well, you're gonna find it hilarious. This music is from a cyberpunk bartending game. <laughs> so right now, I imagine I'm getting ready to open up the bar. I can see that. You're in the bar, you, you're getting ready. I'm imagining I'm flicking on all the neon lights right now. And each big note is another light flicking on. Okay. Now now I think I'm inside your your uh, imagination here. Yeah. And I'm also in the bar, except it's slow-mo, and I'm going across a giant slip and slide in slow-mo across the bar. No, don't do that. Yeah, Rambo. it's in slow-mo, so it's Rambo. just like don't. sexy droplets going Crimbo, everywhere. Crimbo, I'm opening up here. Crimbo, I'm opening up here. It's okay. We have time. Just relax. No! They can wait. They can wait an extra minute as I slip and I slide. Oh, God. Now the floor is so moist, Crimbo. Oh, I like it moist. I like it. A ju I like a juicy floor. The wood's going to be so warped and not just from what it's witnessing. Oh, no. I'm going to turn this into a fucking skate park with my belly. Damn you, Crimbo. Damn You're you. You're going to have to remodel. Oh, my God. I was really far too in there, dude. Jesus Christ. I was way oh, too yeah, in. Nice. Oh, my God. Where was I? Transport to another world of another bar. That ah. bar is now ruined by me. No, but man. It's, 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 what, what's one of the biggest red flags in an anime for you? Uh, okay, red flag is in hell. Like, like uh -oh. what is it alerting well, to? Well, it's gonna, it's, it's not, it's, you now know something's gonna come up that's in the anime that make you go, ugh, boy. Like, it's just one of those things that make you no. go, boy, here we, here's, I gotta put up with this now. Yeah, when they zoom in on anything for too long. Oh. And I'm like, oh yeah, that's gonna be a thing. Can I, can I tell you something? At Crimbo, I feel like you've been yelling stuff at me this whole time, so fuck yeah, keep it up. All right, let's do it. Okay. Yeah. So I, I, I watched. Uh, should it, I'm gonna tell you about a movie. Okay. I don't know if any if you guys seen this movie, but I'm gonna spoil it for you. But I'm not gonna tell you what the movie is. Okay. Okay. So I, I watched a movie where they had a lawn gnome at the very beginning, and they zoomed in and on it just a little too long. And throughout the whole movie, this movie has nothing to do with lawn gnomes. And at the very end, the fucking lawn gnome play, had it played a little part, and I knew it. I knew it because he well, zoomed in. That's Chekhov's gun. No, but that's the Chekhov's gun. Oh, hold yeah. on. Wait, hold on. Hold on. My favorite track. One of my favorite tracks. Every day is night. Cool. Yeah, this is a, this is a real Neon Knight Riders kind of thing. Like, no, we no. got Neon Lights. It's nighttime. Oh, yeah. There's exactly the vibe that Michael Kelly was going for, and he nailed it. And I actually asked him for permission to play this music on the stream, and he gave it. It was very oh, kind wow. of him. Oh, here we go. There we go. Yeah. I love this. Gives off such a wonderful cyberpunk vibe. Oh, I could play a really intense shooter to this game. There we are. And this, yeah, this is, I'm glad that I can share this music with you, man. Yeah, thank you. You have good taste. I, this, is one of, this is one of the hits. My, the rest of my taste is pretty eclectic at best. I guess uh, I guess to be a, a bartender, you have to be have pretty good taste, huh? You gotta be. I gotta be cool with music that I have to listen to right. ad nauseum. Yeah. Oh yeah, definitely. Yeah, that's that, a good point. Well, the thing is, and the thing is, if you're working, you can't have shit with lyrics because that lyrics will distract you. So it's gotta be about beat. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Met that's God with a 34 month re shot, which is why every oh oh and Chi Chi AI, thank you so much for the re for the shot as well. I missed you earlier. Uh, but yeah, no, that's why Christmas music is the fucking death, because it has fucking lyrics. Ah, uh, I see. See, when I used to work at an old, my old day job, we had to listen to soft rock, because hard rock uh, had aggressive lyrics, and it might offend somebody. So, okay. I had to, so we would listen to Nickelback and Rush <laughs> all day long. Ugh. That sounds terrible. Oh, wait. Truly was Monday. Why I mean me twice today's Tom Sawyer me and why do 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 do. That sounds gross. Yeah, I know. It's, it's truly Canadian. So um, yeah, I used to work in sort of a bar. I worked at a Hooters before. Oh, I got a Hooters. Were you, were you hooting while you were there? Yeah, you know, something like that. I was doing a lot of things at a Hooters. 
mostly behind the back room. Anyway, the point is, uh, they're playing. Uh, have you ever been in a fight to the to tubular bells? Can't say that I have. No. Yeah, I have. <laughs> we I was in the Hooters and some guy got too too rowdy. He got too messy, and we had to throw him out. And he was too yeah. We had to beat we had to beat him up and throw him out. And now uh, it was playing tubular bells. Too, too, while, I, while I was kicking him in the ass. Too rowdy for Hooters is a certain level of trash, I gotta say. That's my kind of fun. <laughs> Rings and wild things. Yeah. Uh, you make a lot of heart sings. <laughs> Hell yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now I want wings. Hey, after this, you want to go get some wings? And like a wing I, I feel like with you, you need to clarify what you mean by wings. Mm, the meaty kind. Okay, okay. Spicy meat. Let's okay. go. You and me, we'll go. We'll go to a place, and we'll get some spicy meats together. Okay, but, like, I want it to be one of those places where mm -hmm. you go where you don't bother cleaning your face off to the end. Oh, yeah, no. Okay, good. F that. I want to be like, uh... It. I want to be like this at the end of it. I want to be like, oh, fuck, a wings, my mouth's on fire. <laughs> you draw hentai again, right? Oh, I do. Ah, right, 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 right. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm, I'm, I'm slurping up this wing sauce. You get you your buffalo. How, if you have seen Berserk, who is your favorite character from it? Uh, oh, Berserk, oh, okay. Uh, oh, such a hard question. Guts, obviously. Such an interesting character. I mean, character. besides Guts. I mean, Guts is, uh, I mean, Guts, yeah. I mean, I feel weird. Because I, I don't want to spoil anything, but some of the later later characters uh, were really interesting, and uh, a lot of characterizations that came from the religious arc I liked. Uh, I can say I like uh, I like the skull headed dude, and I like the the the, the um the boy. Uh, yes, yes, the second yeah, the group, cool. the second guts crew, I call them, yeah. and I don't want to spoil them because they're all so fucking good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. they're so sweet. Yeah, they're, and I slow build, and I was not expecting to like them as much as I was. And when I realized what he was doing, I'm like, oh, great. Yeah, mm. yeah. Yeah, the 97 Berserk anime was a great anime. Uh, and I will say, best blooper track of all time. Oh, I, I got to see that. I don't think I've you, seen you've never You've track. never seen the Berserk blooper track. Now, I think we would get, actually, I don't know if we get in trouble for playing that. Uh, oh, no. They, it's, it's rather fun, especially because Eggman is one of the villains. What? So he's oh, just cool. yelling shit. Yeah, what the fuck? Yeah! It's just making a bunch of fucking the bloopers of 1997 anime. Oh, yeah. The Berserk bloopers. Oh, yeah. Are, are, good. They are legendary. And I think at some point you definitely have to check them out. Yeah. I can't play them because I want to hear more. I want you to hear more of this music. And here comes my favorite track. Oh, God. Oh, no. Goop. Ah, 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 ah. Oh. Oh shit. <laughs> I was like, I just put just 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 uh, moisturizing you. You don't mind, you? I really hope it makes my hair look better. Oh. Mm. <laughs> ah. Ah. I tasted it. Yeah. And here's the music. Drive me wild. One of my favorite uh, gaming tracks. Oh, this is nice. This is this has got some hop to it. Yeah, that's why I like it. It's a very upbeat song. Oh, I would love to turn a tight corner to this song. You know that feel, that smooth drifting feel. Oh that's yeah, that's what I want with this song. This feels like you know I I I heard it referred to a couple of ways. This feels like a it's you boiled down the Sega Dreamcast entire soundtrack. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, you know, you're right. This is uh, very Sega to me. Yes, and it has a very that vibe of it, and I think it's one of the best aspects of the game is just the soundtrack carries super strong. Icky Gicky says, "Goop for the Goop God." Goop for the Goop God. Oh, Icky Gicky. Attack on Goop. Hey, I was a blessing the bees and the eagles. Oh, by the way, guys, we're open to more questions again. We got caught up with the questions, so now. Oh, I'm open to anything, even more than questions. Oh, my. Man, I got, I got, I gotta be honest with you there, Crimbo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll be honest with you, Crimbo. I was, uh, I was intimidated when I heard you were swinging by the bar. I was. Uh, 
I knew uh, yeah, I, why. Well, you're, you're you're seven feet tall, Crimbo. Yeah, I, well, I'm almost seven feet tall. I'm a uh, six foot six. You're six six. Okay, as yeah. well, you're, you're 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 a bigger fellow, and you uh you carry yeah, your yeah. you carry yourself as a, a gang leader. Right. But I'm protecting you, so it's all good. And yeah, it's true. It's just like but but like um. Like, who would stop you if, theoretically, you were, like, needed to be? Uh, hmm. Money? You could pay me a money? Okay, let's say you don't have uh, a lot of that. Oh, you know, okay. Do you, do you happen to know Congo? The movie The Congo? No, a VTuber Congo. I think so? Yeah, he is an assassin. He is a, he's a smaller than me, but he's agile, and he knows his martial arts. And I, yeah, I, sad to say, but he's one person that I have trouble taking down. Uh, Simi, if you know Simi, who's a Pantheon VTuber, also cannot fight Simi because uh, uh, ancient Spartan techniques. I can't, I can't deal with it. So I'd say at least those two give me a lot of trouble. Yeah, we see it. We got some, uh, we got some uh, Congo uh, emotes in the chat. I'm they now, I'm, I'm just about. worried. At what point is Mary gonna hire them to kill me? Uh, at what point is it his uh, who? Oh, uh, Mary. Uh, you haven't met Mary yet. Mary is a a, a dog general who plots my demise. Oh. Uh, you see, I I am the embodiment of blue. He is the embodiment of red. We're kind of in a situation like that. Oh, okay. Yes. Kind of a well, blue versus you know red what? situation. If that's the case, then yeah. likely he's going to hire my worst enemies, Rummy and Koki. Okay, and that if that's makes the sense. case, they're pretty ineffective, and okay. I don't think we have to worry. Perfect. They're, sm they're not. E they've proven they're not even smarter than a fifth grader. If there's anything, what a villain should do is definitely underestimate those coming after us. Definitely. Absolutely, without a shadow it's of. It's not a doubt. like we're doing that at all. We no. Would never un no, it's just we are literally. If anything, we would estimate. Yeah, or guesstimate. Yeah, yeah. That's just not even a fully, word. That's, I revenge it to that word back out of existence. Maybe we would just fully mate. We would just mate at that point. <laughs> did I did I leave you at a loss of words? You okay? How do I get out of this situation? How do I get out of this situation, Kirk Taka? You got yourself in this situation with Krimbo. How do you get out? <laughs> I'm doing great, We're Rimbo. How are you? Uh, hey, what are you saying over there? You didn't say nothing? Nothing! Saying nothing. No, I, okay. I, I, mate, 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 date, berate, whatever you, you, whatever you need to say. Okay. So I'll go worry about the estimating, guesstimating, and the mating. And you, you keep, uh, you keep you on your little, um, your rambles. Yes. And I'll, I'll, let me look at the chat. What are they doing? Well, chat, well, chat right now, uh, does... Uh, chat, uh, yeah, uh, 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 the Crimbo spawning event begins soon, Mr. Rue says. Oh, oh okay. Okay, the spot, I don't, that's, yeah. at, uh, Aurora Rose actually is, uh, someone's actually, uh, asked for an evil laugh, so would you like to join me for an evil laugh there, Crimbo? Oh, yeah, you want to give me a countdown or something? Absolutely, well, uh, uh three, two, one. <laughs> oh man. <coughs> now you breathe, breathe. Care about inhale. Exhale. Good, good. Good, Crimbo. Crimbo, breathe, Crimbo. I'm good, I'm good. Good, I'm breathe. Good. I'm good. I'm good. Oh, that's good. I feel good. Ah, uh, someone called oh, Roy Zoga says, I love the guest model. Good evening, people. I gotta say, Crimbo. A lot yeah. of people in the chat outside of character absolutely mm -hmm. adore your model. And that's one of the reasons why I reached out. To, I started following you and watching what you were doing because your model oh, okay. caught my attention immediately because you did something your way. Yeah, do you, you want to know who uh, was responsible? Who was responsible? ARS, ARS. You can find his info in my uh, my Twitter bio, Thingamabob. ARS, ARS has rigged me. He made me he made me have the bones. Mm -hmm. But when it comes to my mommy, I'm my own mother. You feel me? 
That's hot. Yeah, I birthed myself. Oh my god. It was messy. That's an al cool. dude. That's out. That's an alpha move though. That's yeah, some yeah, alpha I energy right there. If no one's willing to birth you, you just birth yourself. If no one's coming space. knocking on that door, you build it yourself. Yep. Exactly. Yep. Exactly. Exactly. You got to get that um, that uh, gumption, that motivation to, to get in there. I think the gumption, really. Yeah. It, yeah. He said it. Yeah. Yeah. Tortilla lady with a 45 month reshot. Enjoy. Uh, oh. My mod says big womb energy. Yes. Mm. I mean. <laughs> We got the wombs here. Uh, I mean, Rel, Rel Lightning Star asked, "Can you time travel, Crimbo?" Mm, uh, yeah, actually. You can time travel. Oh, come on, that's too many powers. Well, sort of. Okay. I have um. So, if you'd like to know, I have a special lozenge, and it lets me sound like I I did in my younger days. So I got a special lozenge, and I'm working on a super secret lozenge that will augment my body form, so I can also look as young as I sound. The lozenge. Yeah, do you not you not know about the lozenge? I I know about lozenges. Okay, you, you, would you like me to take one and you can? Uh, I a you sample? know chat hey, hey chat. Do you want do you want this? Do you want you want him to eat a lozenge? Chat, you want to eat a lozenge? Oh my, oh damn damn chat, calm the fuck down. <laughs> all right, all right. Eat that let lozenge. Let me uh, let me get in my bag here. All right, and let me unwrap this. All right. Just pop in my mouth. I saw it be good. <clears throat> Hello. What's up? <laughs> what happened to you? A lot of things. I. But like my, what? Uh, what? But like what were they? So what? The lozenge uh, lubricates my throat. Makes me sound like I was uh, 17 again. Or 18. I think it was 18. Oh, I'm slipping back. Oh. Wait, wait, hold, wait, hold, wait, but I'm confused. But, but like, what did you do to your voice to change from that to what crim to what you are now, Crimbo? Oh well, you get hit a lot in the neck and the face, and things are gonna happen to you. What, what, box. What, not not everyone. What, have you been uh, hit in the face a lot? I've been punched in the gut a lot. Kicked in the okay. balls a fair amount too. Tick. Take uh, 200 shots to the neck in the mouth, and uh, we'll see how you sound after that. Ooh. No, thank you. Yikes. But that's, uh, oh. <laughs> oh, all right. Yeah. Oh, no, it's coming there back? We go. Yeah, we good. We good. I'm back oh. to normals. Man, wow, you can, like, so you're making another lozenge that not only changes your voice, but changes your body temporarily as well? Yeah, it's got a lot of that uh, vitamin F. I have an F. Oh, good. You need that for your femurs. Yep, yep. And your fingers. I actually found, Googled it. You also need it for your finger bones. Yeah. Hear that? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You got to have a good sausage finger. You didn't get, get oh, oh, I'm, oh, are we wearing glasses? Can we be cool with glasses on then? I, I got to whip out my yeah. glasses. May, may I whip out my glasses? Please do. I will whip out my glasses here. Okay, hold on, hold on. My uh, subservient, beautiful man thing, you. Oh, you're so terrifyingly kind. <laughs> Uh, excuse me, excuse me. I gotta. What's that? I People are asking for finger puppet. While you're doing that, I'm gonna pull out finger puppet. What? You're gonna put what? Wait, what? I'm gonna pull out a finger puppet. What? What's finger puppet? I mean, it's exactly what it sounds like. Oh shit. Oh my god. It's finger puppet. They want. They, here's the voice for finger puppet. Hold on. Hello, I am Grimbo's finger puppet. I'm made of all sorts of evil essences because I have a finger up inside of me. Yeah, you see, there's the finger puppet. You happy? Uh. Does it talk to you? I mean, yeah. Doesn't your finger pop to talk to you? Oh my god! Oh my god! No! 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 Ah! Ah! It's on you. Oh no! It's gonna take over your mind. Hold on. What is happening to me? Ah! You have found a new host for me. 
But this one's bones are too weak. They are clamped like. I told you I needed good anime bones, not weak anime bones. Oh my god, oh my god, let me get this off of you. Let me get this off of you. <laughs> ah, what the fuck happened? So, you remember anything? I remember. I don't know. Okay, hey, you're good. You look good. You look good in shades. Oh, thank you. Yeah, these are That's my all you gotta frames. worry about. I stole them from a kid who wasn't supposed to be in here. Yeah, F that kid. No, actually, no, no. We kicked him out, though, at least. Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, K that kid. Hey, oh, no, Gaudi Oni. Orozaimasen, everybody. Uh, wow. Wow. Hey, Oni, Niko Hans. Orozaimasen. Hey, this is, hey, people are showing up, Grimbo. I'm what not going to lie. What does that mean? Iris, Iris, I don't know. means thank you so much for swinging by here in Japanese, I'm assuming. Okay. That uh, sounds like it's a shorter and would save you time. Ow. I understand. My goodness. People shrinking by the Ro the Ramon Ram Haru Fukuhara. Thank you so much for swinging on by here. The Weary 101. My yeah, goodness, yeah. everybody. All right. Now we got to ask Crimbo and this himbo some more questions. You're free to ask us any questions, everybody. If you Ask us them sexy questions. Absolutely. Please. I need, I, we, we need, we, we have questions. We got a lot of A's to give. Oh, Rune with it. Thank you so much for the shot. Thank you very much. Oh, I love Rune with it. Crimbo. Oh, and DJ Amamiya's here. I love DJ Amamiya and Rail Hungry. Mm -hmm. So many good people. So many good Delinquish. people. Delinquish. Oh, my God. Sorry. I'm getting, I'm getting, uh. Hey, just shout, out your boy. shout out your boys. Shout out your crew. Okay. Shout out your crew. Let me shout you guys out while I can. Hey, oh, my crew, make some noise. Noosey Goosey, Jolly Mad Hatter, Rail Hungry, Rummy Bear. You're not my crew. F you, man. DJ Amamiya. Hey, Tiffany Witcher with the five. Shot, 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 Grandpa. Pal Brook. Oh, my God. Everyone's here. Oh, Ramathal. Yo, you ever seen Ramathal? Ramathal's cool. They're cool? All right. Yeah, Ramathal's like Crimbo. a little ram, like ram man. You need, a, you need a big Crimbo stamp. You just go, Crimbo, it's Crimbo, seal of approval. Oh yeah, all, all these people are proof. Oh, Define Prog, excellent zombie uh, mm -hmm. YouTuber friend. He uh, he he uh, he goes way back with me. He's uh, used to frequent my arcade. Well, oh. it wasn't my arcade when we were kids, but we'd hang out in the same arcade. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. I mean, all 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 arcade uh, buzzards. I mean, they still love it, and there will always be a place where arcades or theaters are never truly gonna go away. Ever true. No, we got There'll we be got big... Krabby Cock and Fuzzy Crimson and uh, Lapis Lazuli. Hey, hey, one second, your character isn't tracking. Oh no, that's just me like freaking out. Ah! I'm sorry, you're not a character. I didn't mean that. Oh no, everyone calls to be a character. Thank like, you. I'm full of character. They're like that fucking character. He's just quite a character. I get what you're saying. Don't Wait, worry. Siggy, Sig Arty, Double O Fifty Eight, Crimbo. Of all the art you that you've drawn. Who oh, have yeah. you drawn the most? Oh man, uh, yeah. the most ever in my life? Yeah. Uh, that'd be Mega Man. I drew a lot of Mega Man as a kid. I drew a, f a full like uh, 200 page comic of Mega Man when I was a kid. 200? Yeah, I drew 200 pages when I was a kid. Damn, dude. That's a, I mean, that's dedication, man. Yeah, uh, huge. I mean, I still love Mega Man, uh, but you'll never. Yeah, that, that was a long time ago. Oh, you got the you got the communists. Well, I noticed you had a certain lighting effect going on, so I had to like. Oh, you wanted to match it. A little bit. Hold on. Oh, there you go. Yeah, this 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 matches. This looks good. There we go. That looks way better. There we go. Now that fits a bit. Hell yeah. Did it. So nailed, it. nailed it. Nailed it. Nailed it. I meant Damn to it. ask you. Ah. The, you got it. You got it. How long is the bar usually open on like a day like this? Uh, I usually go for about uh, two hours, but depending on who's here, we can go longer, uh, depending if they okay. have longer stamina. Because not everyone has the same level of stamina. And yeah, you gotta I got a pretty short stamina myself. Oh, I yeah, last dude. about two. I, I got to say, you've been here for an hour and a half. I wanted to ask you, as good yeah. time as any, because you brought it up, how long can you stick around with us, Grimbo? Uh, two, two to three hours is, is, you know, after that, I like to lay down. I, I, just, I put a popsicle in my mouth and I lay down for Oh, a good. While. That's how you hydrate for the night, right? 
Yeah, yeah. Popsicles Slap are just- in my chest and goo and then put a popsicle in my mouth. Popsicles? Just KO. Popsicles are just frozen water. Yeah, they're yeah, good. Absolutely. I, I, I gotta think up here though. Shade the Crow, five on three shot. What my, what big glasses you have. Wow. Ah. That's a big deal. <laughs> Grumble, I gotta make you another drink. I gotta make you another drink. Okay. Yuri you... Bud with a question. Absolute unit King Crimbo. Two questions, if you will. First, okay. you a boober ass man. Oh, um, uh, definitely. Uh, I think, okay, the ranking goes, I think, uh, butt, gut, thigh, um, eyes, smile, a uh, booba, and, uh, hands. You know what? I'm not gonna lie. You place Booba pretty low on that list, but that yeah. it's fine. Because I, here's I like thing. it. And, and it's no, not, no, no, no. It's not it's, as important. It's not for everybody. It's not for everybody. Yeah. As a uh, as a fellow, I, I mean, I respect. I I enjoy a good Booba like every man, but mm, right. Legs, but ass, ass. Yeah, yeah. Ass. That's just how I roll. Couple That's, of yeah. Couple of ass Tommies men over are here. High up there. And you know what? They could be thin. They, don't get me wrong. I like them smooth, uh, convex tummies. I like the, the the flat tummies, the little pudge tummies. I like them all. Oh, Wayne. Extra skinny, extra big. I don't give a crap. There's just more of you to love. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Absolutely here. All right. I, I, I like contrast. I like, um, like, uh, short, tall, skinny, fat. Like, I, I just like contrast. I think it's cool. I think yeah. it's sexy. It's neat to see what kind of people are out there, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. See, if uh, if you put a, uh, if you put um, if I was uh, the same build as you, we would become less sexy. But now that I have a completely different build than you do, we become more sexy by contrast. It's true. You become you become more you, and I become more me. Exactly, and that's why stables yeah. usually form up. I mean, you're as a as a wrestling fan. That's why stables will have one person of almost a, a differing style to make each right. other stand out against one another. It's brilliant. Mm -hmm. That's that's why. Yeah. Hey, Mila Ninja with a 48 month reshot. Four years. Good conversation for me to come into. And on my four year anniversary, no less. Holy shit. Oh, congrats. Yeah, I know that. Yeah, four years, man. A lot of people have been sticking around. <laughs> this is a good place to hang out for four years. Uh, it's this, this is going to be my first year, but uh, I, I think I, I'm going to make it more than four years. Yeah, I mean hell. Yeah. I mean it's it's a hell of a lot of fun. Oh, Jack, it's a hell of a lot of fun. Jack Jumbo, question: Does Crimbo prefer wearing pants, shorts, or skirts? Same question to the bartender. After. Ah, uh, pants, shorts. Okay, I like to breathe. So skirts first, mm. and and then uh, shorts, and then pants. But you could see. Hold on, let me. Uh... All right. Okay. Oh, oh. I'll answer while Crimbo's stepping out for a quick second. I Shorts are my favorite because uh, I got to bring that dad energy. So I need cargo shorts, obviously. And as well, I I would say uh, pants second. Nah, I mean, God, I've never really worn a skirt. So, ah, my God, you're so. How did. I'm so white. Look at those. What, what are you going to say? I'm so what? You're so, you're so, you're so, you're so larger. So much larger than life. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, that's why. Okay. Yeah, I like them. I like them tights. Yes. You, you see, 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 Crimbo wears a particular style. See, Crimbo's got the thigh spill. Hashtag thigh yeah, yeah. spill. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Where are you if you don't got that thigh spill? I maximize thigh spill for myself. That's good. And that's an imperative thing. Because with maximizing your thigh spill, you are flooding the thigh market with more of your thigh. Exactly. Ah! It'll be my market. Thank you for the goo. I hope it really works with my complexion and my hair. Oh my. Uh, the tights cannot contain Crimbo's power. Absolutely. You guys know what's up. Crimbo! Where are you going, Crimbo? <gasps> he disappeared. Ah! Crimbo! I went behind the glasses for a second. Ah! What the hell happened? Yeah, Milk shots gone. move! Thank you so much for the shot. Appreciate it. Ah! There you are, Crimbo. There's the beef. There's the beef. All the beef. 100% beef. That's all beef, Crimbo. That's what that is, because Crimbo's got a beef with you. So I got a question. Uh, can I get a, spe a special drink? 
Yes, of course you can, Crimbo. Could you make me a drink that insults the intelligence of Rummy and Koki? Yes, I will be getting... Oh, you're going to love this. I'm going to use the ingredients. Rum. Hold on. Okay. I'm pour a little what bit else? of... Oh, what else goes in there? Get this shit. Get this shit. Okay, well, this I'm going to take a little bit okay, of Coke. Love. It, what Coke? And now I'm gonna what? make. And now I'm gonna make them fuck in this glass. What? That's oh up. yeah, they're fucking in this glass right now. Did you just make that up? Yes. Rum and Coke fuck. Yeah, rum and Coke fuck, and it's Is on its way to you. It? All right. Oh now my you, god. Now you can drink rum and Coke. Oh my god, I'm gonna o always order rum and Coke fucks. Yeah, we go. On. That yeah, that's a that's an official one here. Oh, I'm, 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 I'm. I'm drinking I'm what's left. I'm drinking what's left of the Coke. Good job, good job. Thank God if it was a bad job. I don't know how I'd be still getting paid to do this. I wouldn't pay you. I uh, mean, I'm not paying you now. You pay me. <laughs> uh, that's true. We have to run that, break that down at the end here. I, I, oof, oof. Alrighty, folks. La Cuban Libre. Mm. Can I get a virgin rum and Coke fuck? Uh. <laughs> How does that even work? I don't think that works actually, because by nature they have to fuck. Uh, look, see that? Do you see what real hungry uh, pussy with the little emotes? Yeah. That's them. Aw, that's, that's love. That's those two. That's those two dummies. Oh, they love each other. That's love. Because right they're there. stupid. That's res That's love. 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 Long lost love ago. Ah. Okay, I think that goose so soaked into my uh, my hair pores. Oh yeah, it's much shinier. Oh, thank you. It's actually hold you're, on. Um, oh, one second. Hold on, one second. One second. Okay. I'm, gonna let it, I'm actually gonna let it get a little bit oh. there right now. We'll let it get a little bit of. Oh, that looks good. Thank you. I grew it myself because I'm uh, cheap. Oh, beautiful by the second. Oh, you you. Stop it, you. Hey. Ah no. <laughs> ah, you are you're you're being too much. You're being. <laughs> Everyone says I'm too much. They too say much that weight. about me too. I I've been. I've been oh, sorry. What was that? Too much porn. They I'd say be, I'm too much porn. Uh, I'd be referred to as pleasantly exhausting. Oh, <laughs> that's that's pretty cute. I like that. I, I, I'm, it, it's also like I'm like yeah, that's, that's about fair. Uh, <laughs> you, you know what? I t that sounds refreshing. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with knowing how uh, knowing some of the more taxing aspects of your personality, right? You know what? I gotta say. If I'm going to go on vacation with anyone, it's going to be with someone who's pleasantly exhausting because we're going to do all the stuff. Oh, we're going to yeah. like, we're going to go energy 500 percent. Oh, yeah. We're going to get real tired and we're going to crash on the beach uh, drunk. It's going to be awesome. Well, you know what? One of the best things to do is is what? to pass out when you're doing a relaxing activity and forgetting that you're on vacation and waking up in a mysterious land for like 30 seconds. Oh, yeah. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It it's like, what is this? I, I am. I haven't had that happen in a long time, but yeah. And we'll you see. and you look at like the the six people you're naked in, 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 on the floor with. And you're like, who are all of you? you where where do you come from? Six. Six. Why, why not six? Six. Is that too little. Should have been eight. Should it? I don't know. Maybe I like to play it safe. Maybe I think six is a little, uh, you know, good safe number. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I mean, two more of those, you get the number of the beast. Oh yeah, yeah. Mm. Everyone likes a beast, uh, a beast evening. That's true. Uh, what? I, I, I gotta ask you a question. We yeah. asked what your favorite Pokemon is, but no one asked it. Yeah. What's your favorite oh. Digimon? Oh, Digimon. Yeah, we gotta go the other. We gotta go the other side. Okay. Uh, okay. I believe. So, um, <laughs> I'll say two. So, Peony. Who is a VTuber and she's my favorite little possum pal. She takes care of the junkyard when I'm away. Oh. She's very sweet. She loves Digimon more than anyone. And so she her favorite Digimon is my favorite Digimon. And I think, and it, I'm sorry if I got this wrong, I think it's Metal Garurumon. Okay, no, you didn't get it wrong. Well, the Metal okay. Garurumon. Okay, I think that's her favorite one. Okay. And so I would say that's my number one favorite, but it used to be the bunny in the movie. With the, the gun bunny arm. with the gun? With the gun arm? Yeah, that was yeah. a. It, yeah, also, it was a well-animated gunfight, so, I mean, it looked badass. Right. Oh, I saw it in the theater. It was cool. Dude, that movie was peak peak uh, millennial. It was, like, literally... Yeah. That that movie was three movies slammed together. 
Literally, the second oh, movie yeah. starts up with, it's been one week since you looked at me. <laughs> it's like peak that era. It's been. It's been. <laughs> Got everything. Taka and Krimbo, beach episode when? Hey, 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 now. If there's any beach episode, that means we have to have a shonen posse. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, you know the shonen posse. That, it's like a wrestling faction, essentially. But, uh, you get to wear those, like, really absurd booty shorts. Like, the really... You ever seen the old anime where the boys wear just, like... They're basically almost wearing panties with how short their booty shorts are. Yes, like, yes. One half. Wrong on one, one half, yeah, yeah. That's fair enough. Yeah, yeah. That kind of booty shorts is the kind of summer fun we need. I'm not gonna lie, Krimbo. I pay good money to to see you wearing one of those hanging out at the beach. Hey, you pay enough, I might make it happen. Oh shit. Ooh, ooh, wink, oh wink. shit. Well <laughs> <laughs> Oh man, such a 90s goddamn soundtrack. Oh uh, yeah, yeah. Chia AI <laughs> says uh, oh, oh sorry, one second. Ah shit. Chia AI says uh, talk on Crimbo. Oh, sorry. I already asked that question. My B. Ah, sorry. I give you more space there. No, I need, I honestly, maybe I, I don't know how much space I actually need nowadays. Ah. <laughs> Jack, jump my next question. Which food flavor does Crimbo like more? Salty, sweet, bitter, or sour? Uh, savory. I, I'm savory is my favorite. Savory? What's your, uh, what would you say your favorite food is? Let's jump off of that. Let's jump off of that. Hey. Oh god, anything slow roasted. Any you slow roast okay. anything? Oh my god. Yeah. That's good shit. That's good shit. You, just, you, you put a couple spaghettios on the grill, you just let them go, slow roast them at a slow heat until they get just like, just crisp enough. Do you like biting into that, uh, the, uh, you know, uh, you know the, the spaghettio bones and you're getting all the, the sweet spaghettio juice in your mouth? Oh, yeah, get it. Get it. What? Uh, I also like bra uh, what is it? Um, short rib. Short ribs good too. No, short ribs. Oh, hell yeah. Now, that one, uh, that one I will agree with you on too. Actually. Just enough fat to let it slow cook and oh my god. Now, if you like roasted, you like, your, so you like slow roasted meat? Mm, so I do. do. You love, do you love you some Donair? Uh, you mean King of Donair thing? No, here's the thing. Now, Donair meat is the one where it's cooked on, it's where they, they put the meat on the giant spit and it, and it cooks vertically. Oh, 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 like, um, like where they cut the yeah, euros and whatever. Thing, yes, right? yes. There's a lot of different terminology for them. It's around based around the same kind of cooking style of yeah. meat. No, I, I I ate some yesterday. Yesterday I ate a gyro, which ends which ends in O. Yeah, that's oh see that's a great food. I would love to eat a gyro with you. Do you know what I noticed too? I was watching the like I, I was transfixed by the spinning meats. I I could watch meat spin all day. <laughs> Yeah, well, I'm just, I'm just, anyway, hey, hey, um, here's, here's here's the thing. I heard I heard watching meat spin all day is a real lemon party. Oh God, yeah, it's totally a lemon party. Uh, but I saw little not lemons but oranges on on, on top of the meat spin. Oh, figure that. You would have thought it was lemons. No, but it was oranges. Well, oranges uh don't have as sharp of a taste. Mm. Yeah, and so when I was eating my uh my my food, I could taste the hint of. Uh, a musky orange. It was good. That's really sweet. Now that's kind of kind of an effect you usually get from like smoking, right? Yeah. I believe there. I mean, it cooked long enough that there were smoky flavors in there. Yeah. Oh man. Yeah, I, so man, like I, I beef, chicken, goat, see, whatever you need, kind of meat you can get your hands on, right? Yep. Yep. I mean, I, I gotta say the goat thing. If you can't normally get it. Go go get it when it's on the menu. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> get the mint sauce on that. Big sauce for goats. You good to go for another couple, another fifteen minutes or so? Yeah, whatever you want. Fuck yeah. yeah! Thank you so much for swinging by again. I want to thank Crimbo for swinging fucking by the bar today. God damn! And how are you loving this Valhalla soundtrack? Oh, I, I it's you know what? Normally I'd be freaking out and I'd be like, uh, who wants to fight? And I'd be like. Hey man, let's get behind the bar, wrestle! But this this is not the soundtrack's chilling me out. It's uh yeah, it's the game yeah. itself, uh Valhalla. Yeah. It tells yeah. you to pick up some food and drink before you start the game. Oh yeah, definitely. It tells you it, it's smoothing smoothing my vibes out, you know? Well I no matter who you are, no matter how buff you are, no matter how intense you are, everybody needs time to let the serotonin flow in their head. Oh, I agree. I love that juice. Mm-hmm. And that's uh, oh, that juice in me, the serotonins. 
No, that's an injection we could all use a little bit of. What is Crimbo's Auckland's from Super Mega Dude Guy? What is Crimbo's favorite animal to have as a pet? Oh, you know, I, I gotta say, uh, me personally, I vibe a lot with the boar. I feel like me and the boar have a lot in common. Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah. Uh, it's fair. Boar. Boar. Yeah, so I, I vibe with a boar. Yeah. I mean. Right, right, okay, holding on to a uh, boar. I wonder how hard it would be raising a boar. Well, it's a chore. <laughs> I can tell you that. If you got it big enough, could you ride it into battle? Mm. Uh, maybe if you had more. Mm. You could wipe the floor with your enemies. Oh my god. Score. <laughs> I just got a great idea. Yeah, why? Right. Nah, it'll be a snore. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Yeah. We, we got people here. We can't be. We can't uh, be boring. I mean, yeah, I, I, you're right. I'm, I'm worried be. now. The Valhalla music's too calm, but it is calming you. So I, I, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna chalk it up to a glasses yeah. half full kind of situation. Yeah, no, I say let it ride. Let it ride. Let I'm it into ride. it. I mean, I, I try my best to let things ride. Mm -hmm. Gotta let it ride. Gotta let it slide. Gotta let it slip. And gotta let it. I'm out of uh, rhymes for this. It's okay. Slide. Some from, of them stuck. Some of them, they did stick. Yeah, you gotta let Clyde. Ooh, boring or boring? Oh man, everyone's got different hot takes. Ta uh, from standalone Crimbo, if you could fight any fighting game character, who would you fight? Uh, you know what? I gotta say, when I went to prison, uh, originally, as you do, uh, I I I stumbled into a scene. Wait, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You went to prison? Yeah. What you did you go know? to prison for? I'm about to tell you. Oh, shit. Never mind. Fucking I'll shut the fuck up. <laughs> okay, let me tell you. <laughs> um, so I went to prison, but the reason why is uh, I was having a dinner with my friend Andori, and um, yeah, uh, he, he he told me, Hey, Crimbo, the boss is calling. We got we got to go. I'm like, uh, he's not my boss, but uh, yeah, I'll come with, with, with. Anyway, we came on the scene, and everyone's fighting. The fucking mayor. Apparently, they had uh, kidnapped the mayor, and uh, uh, no, the mayor's daughter. They kidnapped the mayor's daughter, and the mayor was on the street, uh, just brutalizing everybody, throwing people in the air, pushing them into dumpsters, what? cracking people fines. I think I remember what? his ads. Do he had I a remember? mustache, right? Yeah, he had a mustache. That's all I really remember. And uh, anyways, the next thing I know. I get put in a figure four leg lock, and I shit. spend four years in prison. Oh shit! Did he woo while he was doing it? Yeah, he went whoa. Damn, I'm so. I mean, friend. they didn't catch you technically. So, uh, yeah. would you say you were falsely imprisoned or fairly imprisoned? Uh, yeah, falsely. Like, mm. uh, I should never go to prison. I no. Why? Why put me in prison? Maybe they wanted There's to. Going. Maybe they wanted to show all the prisoners what they have to look forward to on the outside. I mean, I learned a lot of things in prison. Basically, how to become a better criminal. Okay. So thank you, prison system, for that. I honestly, I, 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 I didn't th really the putting a bunch of uh, criminals in a confined location makes some of them worse. Oh yeah, it's like school. Interesting. 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 So anyway, bes besides that, I had to make some uh, scratch. So I figured out, you know, you know what these boys need? They need porns. Yeah. And so that's how I got to draw uh, porn and learn how to draw porn by making scratch in prison. So you were making uh, so you were making scratch by making scratches. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Hey, hey you I found you found there was a market and you found it and you may and you made yourself a big yeah. player in it. You find a hole, you fill it. That's what that's it, that's, what that's the spirit Crimbo. Yeah, that's the spirit. It's the what's it? That's the that's the getter robo spirit. Exactly, right? And Protect Gaming, thank you so much for the rate of 10 people. Welcome to the Weary 101, where you're not oh. judged from where you come, you're judged by where you're going. Hi, what 10 people, how's your day? Milk Shots Moo asks, what temperature does Crimbo eat his steak? And also favorite cut of steak. Mm, okay. Okay, this is, oh. I also, I'm going to have to jump in here and say that medium rare is how I do it. Mm -hmm. That's how I handle so, it. I'm learning different things about steak, okay? I'm, I'm, um, oh, this is a complicated topic. Okay, but, but, I, I, however, some people might have loaded opinions about steak. Know that right now your opinion is valid. So, uh, 
Leaflet. Do you know Le Leaflet? Yes, they swung on by the bar today. Yeah, yeah. Uh, slime, uh, slime girl. She's really yeah, cute. Yeah, she's a cool she's a girl. Yeah, she knows a lot about cooking, and she had a very good point, and I agree with it, that the more fat a meat has, the more it should cook. So if you get an extra marbled steak, and there's, it's just, it's like a co Kobe beef or whatever. Yeah. You should cook it longer because it fries the meat. Oh. And if it's um if it's got like very less like very low fat, then you should cook it less so it becomes, you know, te it's tender because you didn't overcook that red meat part. I actually that's what if I told you you're the first person to break it down in such a simplistic way? Well, I think Leaf Leaflet gets credit for that. Well, no, but I'm but, happy that you shared that information that Leaflet like shared with oh, you yeah, because I that's that makes a lot of sense to me. Actually, that makes I'll, a lot more I'll sense. I'll something on, on my end. Okay, so I, you know the filet mignon or whatever. The filet mig, mig, mignon, yes. Yeah, the mignons. I mean, no, no. because it's not a working muscle, and and by that it doesn't get a lot of beef flavor. No. If you get a cut like a um, shank, a shank does a lot of work. Now there's your beef flavor. You can use that to flavor your stews and and your, your soup, whatever, with lots of beefy goodness. Mm. So, I'd say shank is one end of the spectrum if you want extra beefy flavor okay if you want a very good um tender cut with not a lot of beef flavor you go with a filet mignon yeah. and and, okay. and if you cook a filet mignon please get that like um reduction on it because it's going to do you favors because it's not a whole lot of flavor in a filet mignon make sure you get a reduction on that i did not expect to get really good filet mignon cooking tips from you that was not my <laughs> expectation today that really no was does. No the taubes with a tier two, two years of support here in the Weary 101, the Talbs, thank you for sticking through me through thick and thin, even though Shut Thick is back again. Shout out to Leaf. I see Leaflet here. Hey, Leaflet, thank you so much for swinging by the bar. I want to thank, seriously, thank you. It's very, it's really cool when VTubers yeah. swing by the bar. I, I really do appreciate it. You should, uh, you should see her cooking. It's, it's, oh my God. What time? She does, does she camps and then she shows her cooking Ooh. and she cooked like a big pot of stew. And oh my God, I'm so hungry. I, I believe food should never be complicated. No, no. I, it's one of the reasons why when I see fancy food, I'm like, that looks great and all, but you know what would be better? A bowl of rice and vegetables with some good spice. Like I just, oh, I agree with you. Yeah, it's all I, I, it's all I really need. Just give me a bowl of rice and good veggies cooked properly with a little bit of protein of some sort. I would love that. Can I tell you, I, a rail hungry is here, and I taught her how to cook something because she didn't know how to cook. Uh, so I taught her a very simple meal. If you have a rice cooker, you know, then your rice is covered. You're good. You don't yeah. have to work, stress out about cooking your rice wrong. So anyone alive should get a rice cooker because it'll do you a huge favor. Yeah. Um, and if you want to cook special rice, like, uh, you know, saffron rice with the whatever, you can cook a different pot. Anyways, yeah. back to the point. You got your rice. You, uh, fry up ground beef. Drain the fat. If you don't know how to cook, drain your fucking fat from your ground beef. Get it out. Or, you know, get it, get it out. And do not put it down the garbage disposal because it'll gunk up your drains. Exactly. Please, please uh, soak it up with paper towels and throw it away in the garbage. Every single city People... says that their drains are nothing but Lysol wipes and fucking drained fat. That is yeah, what it... they're filled with. Exactly. When I take a shower, it, it gunks up the drain and that's bad oh, that's enough. that's not good. That locks down the whole block. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, back to the point. Mm. So you got your fried beef or chicken, whatever. Yeah. And then I like to do um, black beans. Okay. Just oh, oh fuck yeah. I mean, hell yeah. Just throw some beans in there. And then uh, olives. I love olives. Okay. Well, okay. Let's talk. Okay. We're going to talk olives. We're going to start to talk cured talk vegetables okay. and food. All right. What kind of olives? Green, green or black? Oh, God. Okay. Green, uh, green or black? I'm going to say green. Yes. 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 You know we can why? share food. Because you okay, like flavor. Great. Yes, I like pungent, uh, strong flavors. I like my cheese strong. I like no, my, no, 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 no. Uh, Don't say pungent. Refined, refined, refined flavors. Uh, refined flavors. But I also like my women pungent and refined. Oh, there we go. That too. That too. So, yeah. And and my dudes. Garlic stuffed like olives pungent. is peak level of class. I, I agree. And green comes in so many different flavors. Mm. I got some from Trader Joe's that was like a special Christmas flavor. And they had like little herbs floating around. It was so good. Oh, my God. I could I could eat them all day. And it even had the little um, pits in them. But I didn't care because the flavor was so good. You shouldn't eat the pits, though. 
no, they're too crunchy. Oh, by yeah. the way, can I tell you something funny? Absolutely. So I went to eat dim sum with uh, friends before. Mm. Um, and uh, yeah, I, <laughs> a friend of mine, Roxy, she eats very cautiously. So she eats everything like nibbles or whatever. And she's very, plays it safe. And she ate chicken feet uh, for the first time. And she just nibbled the meat off of it, whatever. Apparently you're supposed to do that or something. Or I don't know how you're supposed to do it. I think you're supposed to put the whole thing in your mouth and suck on it. But I eat the whole thing. I just crunch the bones because I didn't know. So I ate whole chicken feet, uh, bones and everything because I thought you were supposed to. I thought that was, I mean, that opposite mouth feel. Yeah, yeah. Apparently you're supposed to suck all the meat off and then spit it out the cartilage. But I didn't get that. I'm sorry, you weren't, we, you. That's when you describe it, I'm just like, man. I don't know if I want chicken for dinner now. <laughs> it's a, it's a, um, it's a little bit of work to get into that one. Fair enough. I also ate a whole crawfish. A whole craw? Uh, what? One whole? What? Yeah. You? It was awful. It was awful. Don't eat a whole crawfish. Don't do it. Please, just deshell it somehow. Yuri Bun with a hundred bits. Look, it's a two handsome hunks. Well, hot damn. Hot damn. We're hot two handsome hunks. Oh, you guys really think so? Oh, that. Oh, I, I know, right? They're just they're. They're making me a blush. Oh, they, they're, oh, shucks. Oh, you're not a villain. You're only a villain because you stole in their heart. <laughs> That's the thing you gotta steal. The number one thing you gotta steal is the heart. Exactly. Oh, purple fish bones is here. I adore purple fish bones. Hi. Hello, purple fish bones. I gotta ask you, <laughs> how did you feel about uh, that one game? You know, res you know, Persona Five. Oh, uh, ooh, you're, you're gonna get me in trouble with Persona Five. Oh no, are you about to have a hot take on Persona? Do you want a hot take on Persona? I mean, if, if this is just how dare you not like media? That's media <laughs> I like. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you. Okay, okay. Um, if you liked Persona Five, cool. Enjoy your games. Enjoy games. You you know whatever. You don't have to excuse yourself to me if I don't like it. That's whatever. It's your business. So it, you know, everyone makes different porn, and I don't judge. <laughs> but you know, porn five, Persona five, whatever you call it, um, it was a lot of style over substance, and I guess that was a little bit the point. It was very okay. flashy. Love uh, those menus. Love the art. Everything about the game, minus the characterizations, was perfect. Yeah. Uh, That's the, the one thing that actually yeah. the game was weakest on was the characters. I was shocked. I, agree. I was That's shocked that that was the problem. Because and, okay, two things. You, uh, it's an well, RPG. Well, it yeah. lives and dies on the characters. It, 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 I will say this. Persona 4, however, their secondary characters weren't as strong as the secondary characters in Persona 5. But the core cast of 5 wasn't as strong as 4. Yeah, that's what I believe. That is that is what I believe. I'm with you on that. Yeah, that's, that's my that's okay. my take on it. So the biggest thing for me was uh, the amount of rep repetitious dialogue. And then you know what I realized? I realized, okay, this is what I, I figured out. Uh, games that uh, take a long time to play, and um, and uh, they have a lot of dialogue that just basically repeats. It doesn't add anything new to the story. It doesn't tell me any new information. So you feel the uh, pacing of that kind of game is very slow. Well, what I what I think is mm. uh, a game like that is meant to play like a lot of hours, mm. and that's made for younger people who are looking for time to kill. They're looking just to vibe in their fantasy, and I and I'm okay with that. But it's not for me. I don't have the fucking time for that. I don't have time to to, to play dolls in the, in the Persona Five and make them smooch or whatever. <laughs> I, I need a game that gets to the fucking point. So. Persona 5, it's not for me. Yeah. It just is. But, the, but I think how you handled that, instead of just shitting on it, you're saying, you're yeah. explaining why you don't care for it, why yeah. it, something it does, not necessarily a bad thing, doesn't yeah. work for you. And I think that's an no. imperative way to parse media. You well, know. two points. I think the game itself was not made for me. No. But I, I still that. think my criticism is valid. They can improve on their dialogue and their characters and their writing. Almost any media can because mm. I don't know. It it suffers a lot for some reason. It's hard. To find this one, it, I I enjoyed beating it. I enjoyed playing it. I enjoyed finishing it, but I didn't want to replay it. And yeah, that was I, the thing. I but with four, I wanted to replay it. 
I and I that. felt that from four, but I didn't feel the same pull from five. That being said, that was Persona 5 Strikers that I've been letting burn a hole on my computer, and I'm like, okay, I'm going to play you eventually. And, and you know what? Just to end it on a, on a sweet note, yeah. I absolutely, absolutely love the graphics, the art design. Oh, it, the, the design, music. The, design, uh, the music. I, 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 I here's the thing. I'm a sucker like, for yeah. three of the tracks in that. Uh, Beneath the yeah, Mask yeah. is a very beautiful song. I, I love... The last surprise. I like it. It's just, okay. it never, it never failed. And I also say, I also think that uh, life will change was also pretty fucking fantastic. Which was the, uh, you're the last, you're running at the boss. Pretty much, you're doing the last run in the zone right. to get to the boss where everything's more intense. Yeah. So uh, yeah, I'm totally with you. I thought the music quality was great, mm. but I'm gonna say one thing: as, as my number one RPG is uh, Mother Three. And and have you played Mother Three? No. There are 200 battle tracks to that game. Wow. Uh, all the bosses have different themes. Uh, there are different kinds of enemies, and the different kinds of enemies have different theme songs. And why is that not in modern RPGs? Why the hell are you not doing that? I cannot listen well, to the same battle song 500 billion times in a row. Please, please I, mix up your it, battle track. It's why I wish they would almost have like a playlist of songs that you could switch through oh, on yes. your system. And like, and then you just like choose that. what you... I mean, the thing is, they included that later on when they had all the DLC. So they included all the battle tracks from all the other games. Oh, brilliant, brilliant. But the thing is, you can't... you can't. I don't think you can set it to have it play random. You have to set it to each one so it plays different each time. Uh, okay. I know, but Yuri Bum without the 100 bits, another one for such a sexy delivery of for differing opinions and being respectful. Now, that is hot as fucking sexy. You studs can call me up anytime. Damn, Yuri Bun. Yeah. My you goodness. know what? I You know what? I, w I don't want to play Persona 5, but I'll totally chill on your couch and watch you play Persona 5. It's fine. I'll yeah. give you a snack. I, I'll ask some questions about the game. It's cool. I've been trying to decide what game to play next, and I have a short list now, and I'm thinking... What are you going to play? I think a Yakuza Like a Dragon, man. I'm, I know please, a lot of people played please, that. Please do it. I But here's the thing. I'm okay with playing that one because I'm not good at fighting games. I'm not the okay. best at them. It's not my... It's an RPG. And it's an RPG. It's a turn-based RPG. And I'm like, oh, that's my jerk. That's my shit. I, I'm that kind of trash. Okay. I'm can I tell you this? Can I tell you this? Yeah. Oh, uh, I don't think my graphics card can handle that game and how beautiful it is. So I would love it if you played it and I could just come watch you. I would love that. Uh, yeah, I, okay, and that's something I'm going to keep in mind going forward, because... Yeah, I don't think I can handle it, but I'd love to watch you play. Oh, fuck, man. Well, that's very... I, honestly, I think that would be a lot of fun to play. And, uh, I'm just terrified. I'm going to show my hand about how little I know about Yakuza, which everyone says it's a great jumping-in period. Uh, yeah, jump I, think, uh, People... I think you got a new protagonist and everything. Well, the thing is, uh, it explains everything that comes up in relation to previous episodes in a oh. way that is understandable to new players. And I'm that's like, smart. that's 5E. I'm like, that sounds like 5E for Dungeons and Dragons. <laughs> please, please explain that a little bit to me. Well, essentially, at that point, at six games, there's too much lore. Right. Like you have to play through them all to understand what's happening, and eventually you uh. need a hard break. So when they were going to make a new game, they essentially took the franchise and split it in half. They created Judgment and Like a Dragon. Like a Dragon, the more comedic side of Yakuza, and Judgment, the more dramatic and fighting games. Oh, that's so... That's they, genius. They essentially took the game, the Yakuza franchise, which was two franchises, which was two franchises right. at once, cut it in half, and is now having them go two separate directions. And I think that's a good idea because, I mean, the Kiryu story's done. Yeah. At yeah. six games, they milked it for all it's worth. And yeah, the yeah, fact yeah, that it didn't end as a shit that. story is awesome. Yeah. Yeah. I love you. Yeah, which I love you yeah, because it's so damn much. One of my favorite series, and Like a Dragon, is a chef kiss. It's a perfect love note to the franchise and soft reboot of it, too. And I really, really badly want to try it out. So, yeah, I think I'm probably going to play that because everyone just seems excited when I mention I want to I play mean, it. That's where my vote is going. Man. You okay. play whatever, but that's yeah, where yeah, my I vote know. I know in the future, maybe next year sometime, I'm going to be playing South Park again. But I'm going to be doing the that's hardest difficulty. That was fun. That's like watching the cartoon. Yes, that's why I think it's it a really good game. like watching... Um, it's like a watch along almost. Yeah, well, it's funny. The the original devs of the first game talked about how they're meeting with 
Matt Stone and Trey Parker was so much what they weren't expecting. They sat down. So what kind of game oh, wow. do you want? And they're used to hearing we want the most popular franchise. And Trey Parker, without skipping a beat, you know, something like Paper Mario, I think, would work good for our graphic style. And they just go, oh, thank uh, fucking uh, God. He knows what he's talking about. And that's exactly, exactly. and that's exactly the game. He, and that's exactly the right game to base it off of. And those guys are smart. Oh, yeah. Those guys well, Trey, well, the thing is, they work, they bust their ass for like three months, and the other nine months, they just take time off play video games. Yeah, they're really smart. I'm envious that they have uh, they have such a good partnership, and they uh, well, they have good people around them. They create such good content. Have you ever seen Seven Days to Air? Seven Days to Air? That is no, the documentary of the start of one of their seasons, and they show the process of making an episode their first week back. And they so they show the seven-day process of making an episode. Oh, I would love to watch that. Yeah, it's on YouTube. You can check it out. It's really yeah, interesting, uh, especially because you can see the pure ADHD madness that is Trey Parker. Uh, you know what I have seen, though? I've seen uh, Cannibal the Musical. Have you seen that? I have not, but that is their film. That's their college film project. <laughs> yeah, please see it. Holds up. It totally holds up. Apparently, it's going to mean like Trey Parker, but Trey Parker's a massive musical nut. So yeah, that makes yeah, perfect sense. True. It's a mu it's probably one of, I don't like I mean, musicals that much. That's dude, more they I mean the South Park movie was a musical for a reason, and then they went on to make the Book of Mormon and won every Tony. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are so impressive. They well, the, the the thing is they're I, I call them artisans. They're yeah, they're yeah. artisans in that uh, they also have a perfect team, and mm. I believe they just have a yin yang balance that they make fucking gold, dude. Hey, yeah, that's hard to find. When you find that, you hold on. One of my, one of my biggest inspirations for writing is Matthew and Trey Parker, but also at simultaneously Philip Lord and Christopher Miller, who made Clone High. Oh yeah. They went that's... on to do a multitude of projects, and then they booked a big one, Cloudy with a Chance of Meatballs. Oh, that's them. And then from that, they got 22, 21 Jump Street, and then the Lego Movie, Twenty Two Jump Street, and then movie 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 and the most recent one they released under their brand i believe was a little known movie called uh spider-man into the spider-verse why are you serious that's oh yeah 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 that, that's not right i gotta say that's my favorite um cg animated thing ever it's probably it's so many it, how the fuck it's a perfect movie. how the hell did they cram a backstory into the middle of a giant crossover cameo while introducing five new villains and it all made sense you, you know it's funny i'm always like i'm always like oh you guys can't handle more than one villain you cram two villains you don't know it. this movie had it all no. but it, but you know what it did you know what i think it did it parsed the 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 right amount of time on miles and hit all his important beats and, and this is this part. is what i'm going to say about philip uh philip lord christopher yeah. miller they know pacing yes they yes. know how to oh pace a fucking movie they really do. And, That's why the Lego movie is a perfect example of that. Yeah, and without that pacing, it doesn't have that emotional impact. No. no. You know, you can't up to it, nothing. And they also, like, uh, again, like, it's so fucking cool what they were able to achieve. You think they start yeah. from doing Clone High and doing Canada Impressions to, like, redefining how people see Spider-Man. Oh, yeah, no, it's, it's fucking, fantastic. fucking fantastic. And, and I'm I, glad. I always thought Miles deserved, like, a big spotlight because, yeah. you know, he, I, oh, he's just... But it was brilliant in doing it in a crossover like this because all the other different versions of Spider-Man and it shows the legitimacy of being other Spider-Man out there in a way that was not condescending to the original fans. I thought it was just a perfect way of doing it. And I just... Is, is I grew up like um, with other artist kids and I knew kids just like Miles. And I it, and it, it just inner city like artist kids that were really smart. Uh, just like Miles, it was cool just to see him be a, like. I love it when real people I see become like superheroes. You know, like I, the, per the me, message I was know. anyone can be Spider-Man. Yeah, like I don't know anyone like Superman, but uh, Spider-Man's so relatable. Like even if I if I'm not 100% like him, like I I do art like him. I know with the inner city. I, I used to do the sticker tagging thing. Like I get <laughs> it. I can vibe with that kid. And that's and that gave you a different perspective on that. Definitely. Yeah, man. Absolutely. Hey, we've gone a little bit over two hours. How you feeling? Uh, I I've, I'm want that popsicle. I want to lay down and chill out. You want to lay down and chill out? Well, I think now is uh, I mean, is a is a good place as Eddie Crimbo. God yeah. damn, Crimbo! Thank you so what? fucking much for putting my bar under your protection services. 
Yeah, yeah, you're good. You just need a couple more good people around here, and I think you'll be fine. Yeah, I think I, I think if anything is proven, I think I need to hire somebody on. Yeah, that might be a good idea. <laughs> I think oh, that, that means I have to do job interviews and shit. Oh boy. Oh, oh yeah, that's that, a whole thing. Well, oh that would that, that would mean I would have like tons of people coming in here interviewing for jobs. Is that uh, is that something the chat would be interested in seeing nonstop? Uh, that sounds cool to me. I mean, <laughs> I'd hire you, Crimbo, but I think oh. you're too busy. I hired myself. That it. <laughs> yeah, I kind of have a no choice bouncer, I guess. Yeah, yeah, I'm protecting your bar. You don't have, you don't really have a say about it. That's yeah. <laughs> that is very much true. Uh... But Crimbo, one more shout out, real fast, in the chat. Where can they find your content? Oh yeah, where can they find your content, Crimbo? Okay, so just to let you know, I actually cleaned up my act just a little bit. I'm going to no longer post my uh, not safe for pornography drawings, whatever, on my Twitter. So follow my Twitter because it's pretty, it's um, only if you're 18. I, I only want you. 18 up. To, 18 plus Twitter. 18 plus Twitter. 18 plus Twitter. 18 plus uh, everything in my life. Just stay away from me if you're a minor. Um, yeah, you can follow my Twitter. You can follow the Rummy and Koki uh, joint account. Uh, I'll post that. Uh, can, some, can you guys post that for me? All right. I know I got, oh, we got our Nightbot already posting Crimbo kills. Okay. Post the the, the, the joint uh, Rummy and Koki uh, thing. One of our that, mods is going to grab that yeah. in one second here. So while you're doing that, Purple Fishbones actually did, 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 shares the pickled garlic all around. Oh, Purple Fishbones with pickled garlic. You want to clean up your blood. That's how you do it. Okay. Here's here's the main account. We, we kind of, we're going to try to post all our best stuff on this account. Ah, no problem here. Artsy Grandpa, real quick, we have a link banning thing. Just be to block bots, actually. Can I post? Uh, hey, one second, we're gonna give you uh we're gonna give you permission real quick. Okay, cool. Or... I'll post uh I'll post the yeah, you guys got my Twitch already, so that's covered. Oh, permission is not a command. Uh you know what? I'll send it to you in the in the what's a Jolly Mad Hatter. Oh, here we go. Primbo kill. Okay, you've been you've been granted permission. To post whatever it links. There you go. Hey, right, Artsy, it's okay. That's just a that's a bot bot. That's a bot blocker. It's okay. That's why okay. the yeah. You can uh, see Rummy, Koki, and more importantly me on that account, and then I'll yeah. post on uh, my Twitter. Hell yeah. And I get real grimy on there, so yeah, just be ready. For You're pretty grimy all the time, but we love you for it. Thank you, thank. Crimbo. You don't kill. Yeah. You kill. You kill us with kindness. I think, if anything. I mean, that's the goal. <laughs> We've killed. You've killed. You've you've killed my sides because you made me laugh a bunch today. But Crimbo. Oh, I'm glad. So Crimbo. We thief. Thank you so much for coming by. And yeah, I'm, I think we got more to talk about, Crimbo. I think you and I have plenty more we need to speak about. Yeah, let's get some wings after this. And, uh, get we'll some wings. Chat. I got to shut down the bar then. That means I got to send everyone packing somewhere. So let's yeah. see who's on right now, Crimbo. Who are we going to be raiding? Who Ooh, are we going to be raiding? I, I think the people spoke them. They want more Crimbo. Between the options of having Ooh. more or less Crimbo, they're like, no, I'm, 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 I'm for, I'm for more Crimbo. This is last. Can I, hmm? can I pick a little S for this? Oh, absolutely. What is their full name? Let me go get. I'm gonna grab it for. You. Yeah, grab it. Let's grab it. This will be a crimbo raid. Yeah. Hell yeah. Thank you all. You could, you, you could come up with the the um the tag. Oh no! This is a uh, from Crimbo and the Weary from Crimbo and the Weary 101. I think that's a good place sure. for Eddie. I want to thank the full artsy grandpa. I want to thank as well Super Mega Do guy. It's just still Tiffany Witcher, Fireman, Masquerina, Apocalypse, Tuna Glitter, Benjo the Bird, Nerd. I sent it to you in the in the thing. Oh man! Oh. Uh, no, no worries. That's just that's just the bot. There's probably better ways of doing this, but yeah, I'm new to all this stuff. Bot, bot, it's bot blocker. Don't worry about it, man. Don't worry about it. And the little uh, there we go. Sending you on the way. There we go, everybody. Thank you so much for swinging by the Weary 101. I'm Takahata the Himbo, and this is Crimbo. See ya. Next I love time. You all. Damn, we had over 500 people in the bar, Crimbo. Hell yeah, that's a good time. I had a great time. I love you. I love Hell you. yeah. See you later. Later.